Hello, this is Mafo from Hacktiv and in this video we are going to take a look to coordinates which is a chord generator. Um, it generates chords from, from individual notes. So for example, I have random notes generating individual notes right here. And if I turn on coordinates, it will create chords from those individual notes. So let's take a look to the parameters. First, we have this knob where you can select up to 20 different chord types. Next, we have inversion where, where you can select the inversion of your chord. Zero means no inversion. You can choose first inversion or second inversion and even third and fourth inversion for those chords having more than more than three notes. Next we have we can choose the disposition. Close disposition means that the notes were will be closer. And open disposition means that the notes will be spread in the keyboard. A little bit more separated from each other. Next we have strum, that will give a strum effect to our chord. We can choose between free and sync value. When you have the free mode, you can select here in milliseconds the value. Positive values will strum up. And negative values will strum down. When you select the sync mode, you can select the values down here. And you can select the direction right here, up or down. And well, those are the parameters of coordinates and you can randomize all of them right here in this section. So for example, we can randomize the chord type it will trigger random values with each individual note coming into coordinates. We can randomize inversion. We can randomize the disposition. Disposition doesn't have minimum or maximum because it only, it only chooses between two values two options, close or open, but right now I'm gonna leave it open. Mm, we can randomize the strum effect, the free strum effect or the sync strum effect. So for example, let's randomize the free. you can set the probability for each one. So for example, if it's set at 0%, that means that it will never create a new random value. And if it's set at 100%, it means that it will always trigger a new random value with each incoming node. And last but not least, we have this preset section right here where you can save the parameter settings. So for example, if I want to save these settings, I can go here, I can choose any empty slot and I can click right here in save and it will save this, it will save all these parameters into the slot number one. Now for example, let's, let's move all the options and now I will save that to number two. And now I can change between those. An easier way and a quicker way to, to change between those is just right here. You can select the slot number right here and when you press this button it will trigger the slot that you selected right here. So now I can change between the slot number one and the slot number two. 
and you can map this into a MIDI controller or you can you can automate this so it can be very useful but honestly honestly my favorite way to use coordinates it's with the random options so i think this is it i hope you find this video useful and i hope you you have fun with coordinates it's free so download it and see you in the next one